This is going to be the beginning of the responsive web design uh, demonstration lection, lecture. Uh, so first thing I want to show you is that you need to uh, envision how you want your page layouts to be. So you should have already watched and read all of the, the articles and lectures and have some understanding of what responsive web design is and what it does. And the approach that we're going to take in this uh, tutorial is graceful degradation where we go from desktop down to the smallest device which would be like a mobile phone uh, as and that is opposed to taking a mobile first approach and the reason that we're doing it that way is because the mobile first approach I think is a little bit harder to wrap your head around when you're first beginning and once you get more comfortable with responsive design you can go backwards and you can start with the mobile first approach later. The first thing that I need to always do whenever I'm figuring out my layouts is the basic HTML construction before I do the CSS and in order to do that I need to get a visual sense of what my pages are going to look like. The first thing I do is I make a drawing so that I can see all the components of my page or at least the major components of my page. You could do this with pencil and paper if you want. So even if you watch this video and you decide not to do it with the tool that I'm going to use, you can still do this with pencil and paper, but you still need to do it no matter what. So the first thing that I want to show you here is how you can use a free tool that's called Google Drawing Application, and it is part of the Google Docs set. So if you don't have a Gmail account, the first thing you would need to do is go and sign up for Gmail if you don't have an account already. 